Epsom Kennel Fitness and today I'm going to be taking you through my home pull workout so that's going to be back and biceps. For this workout all you're going to need is a small set of dumbbells and pull up bar um, but you can always make slight changes to each of these movements and still get pretty much the same experience. I have to say pull day is my favourite day because I get to show off the biceps. Before we start this video, please make sure to like and subscribe so that we can help more people with this content. And without further ado, let's get into the workout. So guys, to warm up, I'm gonna be starting off with four sets of six pull-ups. If you can't do pull-ups, just skip over this part and go straight to the first uh, exercise. But I do recommend you try to get better at pull-ups if you can't already do them. So today I'm gonna to be trying the wide grip. I usually do a more closer grip, but you know, I wanna try something different and uh, yeah, don't push yourself too hard because this is just a warm up. Exercise is going to be a bent over dumbbell row with one arm. If you don't have any dumbbells, get a milk jug, get anything with a handle on, you know, fill a school bag full of books or something. But what you want to do on this one, make sure your bum is stuck out so that you keep your spine nice and neutral. And yeah, just bend over to where you're comfortable, pull straight up like this. We're going to be doing three sets of ten on each arm. Exercise, barbell bicep curl. One of my favorites. Uh, all you need to make sure you do for this, keep your legs completely tight, keep your core tight. We don't want any swinging motion until the end. We want to keep it nice and locked in place so that we're just tight in the biceps. And then on the last set, you can add a bit of swing to it because that's still going to work your biceps more than if you just stop. So we're going to be doing three sets of ten. Right, so the last exercise, bicep curls. With two dumbbells instead of the one barbell. You're going to want to start off in this position and rotate up to here. The benefit of that is work your forearms as well so that you don't just have massive upper arms and really spindly forearms. So we're going to be doing three sets of 10 on each arm and they're going to be all today. for today's video. Use this workout as a building blocks for uh, your own workout. You can add or subtract any exercises you want to this and it will be a pretty solid back and biceps workout. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and this has been Tom Kettle Fitness. I'll see you in the next one.